Hello folks. Well, I've been trying to fly a little bit with all the hit and miss weather, but went ahead and decided to take my SIG Cadet out that Mike Hansen brought me last year. I had a SIG Cadet years ago with a KMB-40 on it and night lights. It's a great flying plane for sure, and this one flies the same, albeit I think it would fly just fine on 11.1 volt battery versus the 14.4 one that Mike also brought me. It has JR servos, a Castle ESC, and a Spectrum AR400 receiver. So let's take it out and get some fresh air, which is blowing at 18 mile per hour and a warm 42 degrees. But at least the sun is shining. <laughs>
put her down. Well, I want it a little bit closer, so I'm going to go around. Which way? You know, the wind is really strong out of the west, which is to my back, so I'm landing in a total crosswind. I have no headwind to slow it down. This plane has such great wind penetration, it doesn't want to land. Oh well, I love practicing landings. Thank you, Michael. I need some more down trim though. This is Monday. Well, as you can see, the weather this week has changed again, and soon I hope I'm going to be able to test my friend Bud Perriott's airplane design called the ASP, Air Superiority Project. It has two ducted fans and no elevator. The elevation is actually controlled by the vectored thrust, so stay tuned by subscribing to see what happens. And thanks a lot for watching, and especially thanks to Ilya for the second camera footage. This is a Night Flyer, signing off for now.